Yo, what is up everybody? It is Sweep here and we are back with another banger video. Today we are currently number 10 on the ladder and we finished number 11 in the global tourney. I'll show you guys right now. I uh, I fell asleep and didn't play my last two games. Oh well, it is what it is. We still got a new best finish so honestly super happy about that. And yeah, let's hop into some ladder games and let's talk about the new uh, champion coming out. So new champion is going to be 10 Elixir which is crazy to think about. So it's going to be 10 Elixir and it's ability, it's it's like two units and his ability sends out like a dashing dark prince. Oh, it's it's going to be sick. The first ever 10 Elixir card in Clash Royale. It's been about time since we uh, have seen this. People are going to be like, yo, this card is so no skill. But you know what? That's kind of cool. You play one 10 Elixir, just tank of a champion. And yeah, that's gonna be crazy to play with. I don't, I don't even know how it's gonna work, but I'm super excited for it. It's about time we got a new card in this game because it's been a, like a whole year basically since we got the last new card. And I'll queue to when we're in a, in a live game. All right, we are versus Denisito. I got my ass handed to me last time I played this guy. Let's hope it's not the same experience. So one thing I noted about versus Denisito is never activate your king with the fisherman. Why? Because he will go giant skeleton. <laughs> That is why we're, we're going to go Skelly King here. And hopefully everything is good. And yeah, this is to be expected. Uh, we're going to go Goblin Dragon in the back here. Because maybe like, this is a bit of a weird play. And you know what, you're right, it is a bit of a weird play. What else am I supposed to do? Okay, I want to go Fisherman. For this, and just arrows everything he plays here. I think that's the best play we could have done with our hand. I think it's two hits still. Yeah. All right, so yeah, this is gonna be a really tough matchup. Um, I don't know how I'm gonna win this. I probably gotta abuse Skelly Dragons and make sure you make him like fireball him. But man, it's gonna be tough. It's gonna be really tough. Um, we could split. We could split Skelly Drags because you know he's gonna have to respond to one of them. And yeah, okay, this is okay. We're chilling. Mm, I wish I had Rage in this matchup. Rage is Rage versus Skarmy is so good. There we go. He has to tank all that. And yeah, we're chilling. We're chilling. All right, we're just gonna go Skelly King in the back. I want some good fishermen here. This is fine. All right. A little weird hand we had. Oh, go down. All right, that's actually really good for us. Good. Bob all this. NATO actually works really well. Go Skelly King last second. All right, yeah, like I said, this is, this is gonna be pretty rough. Skelly drags up here. Yeah, he's gonna play that. We might be looking at a good fireball at the bridge as well. I'm hoping to do. He plays all of his troops. Yeah, play all that. Yes, yeah, Skelly Dragon's kind of popped off there for us. Which is what we want to happen. Okay, here we go. I don't know what's happening. I'm scared. I'm scared, Poppy. He missed one. It's really good for us. Actually, let's just go in here. We have to get the Skarmy ready. Oh, I did not do what I wanted to do. That's fine. A fisherman here. Hope from to do this. Put that down. And maybe go in here. And get everything ready. Yeah, there we go. It's really good damage for us. We got this fireball. 
Hopefully that does something. Okay, his hand was super weird there. Goblin Giant, please be broken. Alright, that's pretty broken if you ask me. Alright. E. Don't hit. I got a fireball again. I lost. I I, I think fireball arrows took his tower. But I was just too bad of a player to do that. So that's that's just my mistake, and I will take full responsibility for that. But I think we played that match pretty good. It, it, it's a hard matchup. You, you have to punish him for his weird cycles with the uh, giant skeletons. But Fireball Arrows, I think, took that 256. How much does a Fireball do? Doesn't Fireball do like 254? Uh, how do we see level 14 Fireball? I don't know how much level 14 Fireball does. We'll check next game. But yeah, I, I could have won that. That was my mistake. But yeah. Alright, reverse sauce. So this is actually a this case this is actually a really good matchup. This guy this guy run, like runs recruits. So basically we're just gonna wait. <laughs> That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna spot some of the good luck, we're gonna mute the emotes, and yeah. Does that first play, we're gonna split skelly drags. Um if he goes hogs, I want just wanna go knight and go night witch and go goblin at the bridge and win. That's the plan. Alright, so we're gonna go knight in the back. See what he does here. Go for our Night Witch. We're gonna fireball this. Because we have Skeleton King for the opposite lane. You know what? We're looking okay. We're looking okay. That's gonna like kill it all. So like I'm not really worried about that. We're just gonna go low Skelly King here. He's gonna go for his hoggies. So we're gonna go preemptively go Skelly Drag, so he can't do that. And we're looking fine. Looking fine. That's not gonna stop him. He's gotta play something else. See if he has anything for this. Does he have arrows? Mm, that's okay. Alright. Just gonna go Fisherman in the back. Because it's the slowest card we have. Got arrows all this. He missed the fireball, which is kind of funny. Alright, but this puts us in a good spot because, like, his hand's not going to be great. Our hand's not going to be great either. So I guess we're not talking a lot during this game. Um, kind of trying to focus so I don't completely throw. Yeah, here's the kind of the push I wanted to do. Goblin down at the bridge. Okay, this guy and missing his fireballs is uh, gonna cost him the game, probably. If I'm being honest. So we're just gonna spam here. Because I don't know why we wouldn't. But yeah, that's kind of what I wanna do is just spam everything at the bridge. And try to get that elixir up. He's actually doing a good job with this one troop defending. He's gonna go recruits. Yeah, that's expected. Okay, he's actually defending, so uh yeah, it's not looking good for us. Go fireball that, get no damage. Go for the fisherman here. Why are my troops doing nothing? Do something! Alright. Okie dokie. Okay, boys. Why am I throwing this really good matchup? Someone please explain the lore to me. Why I'm throwing this really good matchup. Oh, it's because I'm missing my fireballs too. Would you look at that? 
practically the same person. Alright, let's see what we could do here. I'm gonna kind of pop everything off right here. And we should really get a good Goblin Dragon at the bridge as well. Let's go to kind of fireball arrows all this. Thoughts? Pop the ability as well. Go Knight here because of the uh, troops. And yeah, I think we can go Goblin Giant at the bridge in this lane. Kind of hope for the best. We got Fireball, we got everything. Arrows all this. Let's get a Fireball. Probably could have waited for the opposite lane. Fireball and defense here. We're gonna go Skelly King. We're gonna go. We're gonna go in actually because we have to. That's the game. Oh yeah, that was like, that game was a lot closer, boys. Almost to a really good matchup. He he played really passive, which was honestly the smart move to do. Um, that's what I would have done. So yeah, look at that. We're one one. Let's try to get one more win in. And yeah, yeah, we're 11th, we're 11th, not, not great, not horrible, not horrible. Um, let's see if these Q times are still ridiculous and I'll, I'll cut to the next game. All right, versus Dominic, one of the best players in the game, um, especially at beatdown. This guy finished number one, like way too many times account. So let's see what we can do against this guy. Like what can we cook up a storm here? Well, we'll start with the good luck and we'll just go with a, uh, We'll go with Skelly King, Skeleton King in the back. This could be Hog. This could be a lot of things. He's known to run a lot of different decks. So we'll see what kind of version we're getting today. Right now, I got no clue what I'm running. So we're just going to pop the ability. So, you know, slowly. Reverse Lava Hound. Okay, that's what it is. I don't know why it took me so long to process that. But we're reverse Lava Hound right now. And yeah. So we're gonna take his tower here, unless that bomber actually clutches up. Yeah, that bomber's that bomber's on some G shit, bro. What is this? That bomber is crazy. So he's, he's not gonna have the fireball. So that's why I'm okay to play skelly dragons here, because I know his cycle. <gasps> skelly dragons, yo, 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 worst card in the game. Worst card in the game. All right. Do you, do you guys think we could, we could get the timing for the uh, fireball? It's like this. But I didn't get it because I'm a bad player. <laughs> okay. Okay. This is rough. This is rough. These balloons at the bridge are actually really horrible. Um, yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm probably just gonna go night at the bridge. What else do I do? Yeah, like this is this is over. I I, I don't know what else I could do against a player at this caliber. We'll, we'll, we'll try our best to see if we can come up with anything else, but from this point on, like I, I just don't, I, I don't see it. Unfortunately, even with like a perfect fireball like this, I said I just don't see the win. Yeah, I, the I, like the eye drag is too much for me. Yeah, I had to do something like this earlier. Like, we should be able to take his tower, but, like, look at that. Like, honestly, I think a bad start, too. He never actually went Lava Hound. Like, he knew my deck from the rip, obviously. But, unfortunately, that's just some matchups you get. Uh, let's try to play one more game and on, like, a good on like a win. <laughs> you know what I mean? But, yeah, like, he knew my deck. That's why he played that way. But if he didn't know my deck and he actually went Lava Hound, I think we actually had a chance of winning. But just going Bloons, like, playing that deck like Bloon is way smarter because I don't have any actually good air counters. And he just snowballs my Night Witch and he just fireballs my... <laughs> Um, what you call it? He just fireballs my skelly drags, and I just I'm fucked. <laughs> so yeah, so I'm gonna do one more game. 
All right, last game versus Juancho. This guy runs a weird deck. Um, it's it's like it's like log bait, but like more annoying. So yeah, we're, so we're gonna take some damage in the left lane. I don't want to overcommit versus a super baity deck. I'm gonna go Skelly Dragons here, and I, I was low key gonna prediction fireball, but check this play out. This play's gonna go crazy. We're actually just gonna hold it right here. I play this so smart. Hopefully we get pretty much everything. Yeah, we do. If we have to, we get fireball. And if we have to, we'll take the wallbreaker hits as well. Almost. Okay. Great start. You know what I mean? Great start. He uses barbs way too early. The ladder goblin giant run three, like run free, because I could spell anything else, and that's just a great start. And let's just look out for the wall breakers. Here they come. We go knight. We got skelly drags. He, so he's minion horde as well. It's something we gotta look out for. He's gonna play princess right up here. Where I can't even play, but he's gonna play princess right around this. What the? Bro, he's trolling. You gonna go goblin gang? I'll take that damage. That's fine. Mm hmm. I knew, I knew this was coming out. It sucks, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. Low key. Low key okay with that. Low key. I, I probably should have just gone Goblin at the bridge because no, he didn't have Evo Barbs or like enough licks for it. And once I got on tower, I could have just fireballed it at the bridge. Anyways. We're, we're unfortunately have to play same lane here with all this troops coming down. Yeah, like this. It's just kind of annoying. I'm actually choking. Like, it's just a matchup I never play. So, of course, I'm going to be played a bit wrong, Bruce. It. Yeah, he knows he can't play his barbs, and I just go this at the bridge, and we win. Yeah. Okay. I I I knew I couldn't go opposite lane because fireball doesn't kill evil like uh, evil barbs. So I had to keep playing same lane and build a big enough push to where he overcommits in the right lane from a counter push, and then I go, you know, in the left lane. So yeah, like how annoying that guy's deck is. Yeah. After going pretty much even, we're down to 21 with two wins, two losses, which is how ladder works. You gotta win way more than you lose. So yeah, guys, thank you guys for tuning into this video. I'll see you guys in the next banger. And yeah, once the champion's revealed, I'll make a video on that too. So yeah, guys, peace out.